Hello YouTube and welcome back to this course on learning advanced custom fields with me, Benjamin the Dev. Okay, so in the last video we created the CPT UI and we created our ACF fields. So now let's actually populate this with some data from a user's perspective. Okay, so we're now we're here in our dashboard. What we can do now is we can see that we have restaurant reviews. So we can add a new restaurant review. At the moment there isn't any at all so it says enter title here now in a previous video we did say we were going to change this to say that it would say something like add restaurant name here so let's go ahead and edit the functions file so if I go in my code editor and we're going to functions you can see here I've written a little function already for the car review one. So orders, we'll just copy and paste this. And we'll just make a little comment. So this one will be the restaurant. And what we'll do is we'll just make a comment here so we know what we're doing later on when we come back, car review title. So we're, we've got a function new car title so what we need to do is we need to change that so it says restaurant and we need to copy and paste that bit of code there so in our function we've got our title we've got our screen and if we go back it says here enter title here so what we need to do is we need to do restaurant reviews here And this restaurant reviews is actually our slug in the CPT UI. So if we come back to here and we go to, oops. Okay, that's probably because what's happening is it's, we haven't changed it here. So give me a second and let's just change this. So add new restaurant review. That's fine, restaurant reviews equals title, yeah, 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 let's go, let's refresh, or let's try and open the CPT UI. And now you can see we haven't got the white screen over there. That was happening because what happened is I did not, cha I changed this title here, the new title review function, but I didn't change it here, so it caused it to white screen. So now, uh, what was I saying? I was telling you about, our right, yeah, so here, our restaurant reviews this is our slug so if we go down to restaurant reviews on this one you can see it's our post type slug it's restaurant reviews that's this here obviously that's a car reviews of my test one from before so now we can say enter your restaurant review title so if we go back here we can see it says enter title or do so do a little refresh and now it says enter your restaurant review title but actually we want to enter your restaurant name So the name could be, um, let's think of a restaurant, uh, Big Ben's restaurant or Big Ben's, there we go, Big. And as you can see, we've got this box here. So actually in, back in our custom fields, I was going to turn off permalink, the content editor, the excerpt, the custom fields, discussion comments, reviews, slug, yada, 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 yada. So we're going to do that and actually we'll see that in here it will be a bit, a bit better for us. So let's go back and update and we'll just copy in, hmm, yeah, let's just review, let's leave this page. We'll just come back to this. So now we've got enter your restaurant name, which is Big Ben's. I don't really like the name, uh, Ben's Chicken House. That sounds good. Okay, location. Well, we can have it in, I don't know, where could we do like Los Angeles or LA or downtown? I don't know. Let's choose, let's just choose, I don't know, Brighton. So there we go, Brighton. So let's just say it's a chicken shop. 
and the food quality. So we're presented with awful, okay, good, great, great. There's an error there. And I'm guessing we're gonna get that error again. There. So let me go back into my field group. This is why it's always good to kind of test it out from the user's perspective before actually going into deployment. So let's go to food quality and let's have a look. Oh, we've got two lots of great greats. Why would we have two lots of great greats? Food quality, food type. Yeah, quality of service. Do we have a great great? We do have a great great. It's so good, it's great, great, great. Right, okay, so now we've cleared that up. Let's, let's just publish this so it can save into the database. Okay, yeah, actually we can't do that. So let's just go awful. Let's go three stars for my chicken shop. Quality of service, let's go okay. It's okay, it's good, it's okay. Right, so a nice review. I loved the chicken here. It was, why not? Let's do it. Good, good. There we go, perfect. Okay, so we've given it three stars. There's food quality. <laughs> Good. Let's just make it fun. Let's just say awful. Let's just make this a fun review. Right. So now all our fields are filled out. Perfect. And hopefully we can see. Are we still getting the great great? We're still getting the great great. We are still getting the great great. Let me just go back into the advanced custom field and we'll have a look at that. So why have we got the great great? I don't understand. You should be saving. Right. Save. Please don't say great, great again. This is bizarre. Right, I think I know why. Because what you're supposed to do is create a space. And that makes sense. And now it really will be great, great. Okay, so that's updating. Let's have a refresh of our review of the restaurant, of Ben's Chicken Shop. And we can see that we can, great. It's so great, great. So in fact, let's, let's try and get a little, uh, if, it, if anyone's on Twitter and they're watching this video, just tweet me, hashtag great, great, just for a laugh. I might give you a smiley, smiley face back of the great, great. So yeah, so it's good there, we've got great there. Um, let's, we gotta do great, great, really do. So seriously, location, Brighton, Food type, chicken shop, food quality great, three stars. I think I'm gonna be kind of give myself four stars. Why not? Quality of service is great. Of course it is, you're at Ben's chicken shop. And the review, obviously it's not so long, but let's add a little bit of my favorite Laura Mipsum. I'll just copy just this. Just now, it was good. It was good, good. No, it should say it was great, great. It was great, great. Hashtag great, great. Hashtag great, great. At Benjamin the Dev. Hashtag great, great. Okay, so cool. So we've got one of the one review in here. Now, what I'm going to do, not in this video, I'm going to add a few more for our next video. Okay, great, great. We've added our data. Now let's move on and edit some templates, create some custom templates for displaying on the front end of WordPress. If you like this video and you think it's great, great, hashtag great, great, please like and subscribe. Um, say hi to me on Twitter at BenjaminTheDev and uh, look out for the next video. Thanks for watching. Cheers.